Hey, hi. My name is Richard. I am basically MBA with 22 years of study abroad, constant experience. And in this series, I'm going to talk about Canada visa success. I have already completed a lot many videos for US visa success. So in case you have not checked them, go check in the playlist and you will find all those videos. More important, do like, subscribe, hit the bell icon so that you get the latest notification because we come out with a lot of videos, informative videos that can really help you in your study abroad dream. Today, I'm going to talk about the Canada visa success, the first process, which is what study have you done and what program you want to pursue? What do I mean by that? Have I done BBA and am I going for a program which is hospitality? If I'm doing that, then probably I will have to justify why I am changing this in my visa SOP. I would suggest go for a related program because if you are not going for a related program, the visa denial rate is more in Canada. So the first success to basically get Canada visa is to apply for a related program. Look at what subjects you have done, what you have studied and apply to a program which is related where it matches the subjects that you have done, where it matches the curriculum so that they understand that you are going for further education so that you want to go more in your career. If you are going for unrelated specialization, they feel that you are confused, you are not certain what you want, and that will think that you are not a good student and they will reject you as a potential immigrant. So for Canada visa success, the first thing is apply to a related program. Now, if you have work experience, your work experience has to be related. So you have to get a work experience letter, whereby in your work experience letter, you need to mention your work profile, what work you have been doing. So that the visa officer can understand that the work that you have been doing and the program you want to wish to pursue is related. So your education qualification that you have done has to be related, your work experience has to be related. And if, the, if there's a good relationship between what you have done in the past and what you want to do in the future, the visa success for Canada is good, okay? So remember this first step that I'm going to cover, cover that I've covered in this video is apply for a related program. In case you want to get our study abroad counseling, you know, Zoom one-on-one -on -one meeting, which is free, click on the calendar link and you will get this first meeting free for yourself. Where I will be basically going in depth with your profile to understand whether your profile is eligible for admission, scholarship, and to answer your visa queries as well. Do take this opportunity and have a good day. Till then, take care. Bye.